Hey, I'm Steph, how are you doing? Hope you're well. Welcome back to my channel and to another video. So for this week's video, I'm bringing you a quick Autumn Outfit Ideas a video based around styling the flannel shirt. Uh, so I've got five flannel shirts here behind me. Uh, they're all from my wardrobe. Uh, they're all vintage styles that I've had for a number of years. Um, styles that I just love to dig out every autumn uh, and wear pretty much on rotation throughout uh, this season. Now I think flannel shirts are great for this time of year, they're great for an autumn look, uh, not only are they cosy and warm, uh, they also work great as a layering uh, piece. So yeah, work great as an extra layer um, over lightweight knits, uh, over roll necks, over hoodies, um, even over chunkier uh, knit jumpers. So if you kind of were to go for like a larger, kind of more uh, over shirt style in a, in a larger size, uh, they work great uh, that way. Uh, and also work great as an alternative to a jumper. So say on a day you're not feeling wearing a jumper, you can definitely opt for uh, a flannel shirt and maybe wear it over a um, long sleeve t-shirt uh, or even a buttoned kind of long sleeved Henley top. Um, so yeah, I think overall they're just a great uh, casual shirt to have in your autumn wardrobe. Now I'll wear these for uh, a casual look. So I wear them, you know, out and about in the daytime, uh, on errands, uh, but also on day trips, on weekend trips, um, going for a walk in the park or in the forest. I mean, any kind of outdoors kind of activity, I think they're a great uh, star for. Uh, but also, you know, meeting friends. So say on a cozy kind of Sunday, if you go into the pub uh, for like a Sunday roast, uh, if there's an open fire, even better. Uh, they're kind of a great star for that. Uh, or going to a friend's house, say, you know, on a games night, maybe on a Saturday night, just, you know, like, and you're looking for like a cozy kind of, um, kind of warm kind of shirt style. Um, I think they're great uh, for that. So yeah, pretty much kind of any kind of casual occasion. So I'll be talking through each shirt, uh, telling you exactly how I've styled it. Uh, you'll also be able to see me wearing the items uh, in the clips I'll insert here on the side. And yeah, just really hoping to give you some outfit ideas uh, around styling uh, flower shirts for the autumn. So let's get straight into the video with the first look. So up first, I've got this vintage one from Pendleton. Now Pendleton are a great brand to look out for uh, if you are going vintage shopping or thrift shopping. Um, they do really, really nice flannel shirts. Um, so I picked this one up uh, a number of years ago and I just absolutely loved the colours. Uh, I thought the reds, the blacks and greys just worked really great for autumn. Um, I love the design of this one as well. It's got this kind of uh, 50s kind of retro kind of open camp collar uh, there. Looks great over like a black or white t-shirt. Um, I also love the pocket detail here, this kind of open flap pocket detail um, and this particular one actually comes with um, some suede elbow patches as well so just yeah extra kind of uh, outdoor kind of rugged kind of uh, design detail there in this one um, now this one's a medium they do come up quite large uh, so for styling this one because it was quite long I've actually tucked it in um, and you'll see I've tucked it into some dark blue uh, jeans now these are the River Island uh, Dylan style they are my go-to for uh, slim fit jeans. I think they're really nice. And I think, yeah, if you are gonna kind of do this look, I would say probably stay away from like the too kind of skinny, too tight uh, jeans. Uh, and kind of stay for something maybe more slim fit, regular fit. Uh, but so yeah, these are my go-to kind of dark blue jeans uh, all year round pretty much. But I think these shirts go so well with a pair of jeans. So then I added this uh, brown leather belt. Uh, this is just a vintage one that I have that I really like with this kind of lattice effect and a brass buckle, which I think kind of like works really great uh, for this style. Um, and then I tied in the brown leather from the belt uh, in with this uh, vintage brown leather aviator jacket, which is a favorite of mine uh, in autumn uh, around this time of year. Absolutely love this one. Uh, I think the brown, yeah, works great for this uh, season. Um, so yeah, paired that together and then I finished the look off with um, a pair of outdoor kind of boots. Um, these are great uh, as well for this look. Uh, work great with flannel shirts, dark blue jeans, a leather jacket I think just makes for just a really really nice look. Uh, these particular ones are from Polo Ralph Lauren. Um, I got them on ASOS about five years ago I and mean, I thought the red and black laces tied in so well with the uh, red and black uh, of the shirt. So up next is another shirt from Pendleton. Uh, this one I, again I just love the colours. I love the kind of more tealy blues and greens of this one uh, but then it's got this contrast kind of red stripe which I thought works really really nice um, and then a bit more of an exaggerated collar on this one uh, a bit more of a kind of a 70s I want to say collar but again that kind of retro kind of open camp collar I thought was really nice uh, again 100% virgin wool uh, which makes it really uh, cozy uh, really nice and warm so uh, yeah again a great one from Pendleton uh, and again this one was in a medium uh, but not as long as the other one so uh, yeah I kind of wore this one uh, untucked for this particular style 
uh, but again went for the dark blue uh, jeans from River Island uh, and you'll see for most of these looks I've paired the shirts with a pair of dark blue jeans because I think it just goes so so well. Um, again opted for a leather jacket uh, but this time in black. Um, this is kind of more of a racer style uh, leather jacket, uh, which I think also works really nice. And then I finished the look again with the same uh, black kind of outdoor boots, uh, tying in the black leather there of the boot with the black leather jacket. Up next, we've got this shirt from Woolrich. Now, Woolrich is another uh, great brand to look out for if you are vintage shopping. They do amazing uh, flannel shirts. Um, I'll leave their website linked uh, down below. But uh, yeah, another really nice one, uh, another kind of wool one. Uh, love the colours on this one, the blues, uh, the mix of the blues, the greys, the reds, um, I thought was really nice. Um, so yeah, I've kind of gone for more of a kind of a blue look with this one. Um, again, I've gone for the same pair of uh, denim uh, dark blue River Island jeans. Um, and I've gone for a more of a kind of workwear look. Um, so I think these, I think the final shirt's got a great for, yeah, kind of vintage workwear look. So I've uh, paired it with this uh, denim. Workwear style jacket, which I love, uh, another vintage one. Um, yeah, if I find any uh, similar to this, I'll link them down below in the description box. Um, I also added a beanie, so yeah, kind of tied in the blues there with a blue beanie. This one is from ASOS, I actually picked up in summer uh, in their sale, so I'll try and see if it's still uh, available. But it's just like a kind of fisherman style uh, beanie. Um, and then I finished the look off again with the same pair of black uh, outdoor boots, just because they just go so great with uh, this style overall. So up next is this very classic uh, black and red check shirt, uh, very much in that kind of lumberjack style. Um, I love this one, I think this is such a classic. Um, I've had it for a number of years, never goes out of style. Um, and this one's a bit thicker, so I kind of like to wear this one uh, in more of a, an overshirt uh, kind of style. So that's exactly what I've done. Uh, I've paired it with this uh, lightweight uh, jumper from Uniqlo. Um, I went for the black uh, to kind of tie in with the black check in the shirt. Um, I again went for the same pair of dark blue River Island jeans. Um, yeah, pretty much you'll see most of the styles. I've gone for the same pair of jeans. Um, I tried it with different styles of trousers, like brown chinos and beige chinos, but it just didn't go as well as with the dark blue jeans. So I kind of kept going back to the same pair. Um, and then I finished the look off with this uh, leather jacket, this racer style, which I think just looks kind of really nice and kind of rugged um, and just goes so well with the flannel shirts and just the look overall, which um, again, finished with the same pair of black leather, kind of rugged outdoor boots. Um, and again, the black leather of the boot, I thought went really well with the jacket. Um, and then the red and black laces tied in just perfectly with the black and red check of the shirt. So onto the last shirt uh, is another one from Pendleton. Uh, really nice kind of traditional red tartan uh, in this one, uh, which again, I think is perfect for this time of year, um, especially as we kind of head towards Christmas and you see a lot more kind of reds and things like that. Um, so I think this uh, red tartan is just beautiful for this time of year. Um, it is a lot more of a kind of lighter weight shirt, so more of a kind of Oxford shirt uh, style. Uh, but again, it's a wool one um, and I wanted to include it just because yeah, it's Pendleton and it kind of ties in with the other uh, checks, uh, the other checked flannel shirts. So yeah, so I would wear this one more kind of on a night out. Um, I think this would look really nice. So that's kind of how I've styled it uh, with that in mind. Um, so I've paired it with a pair of black uh, kind of chino style trousers. Uh, this is just a simple black pair that I have from uh, River Island. Again, they're kind of a similar kind of fit to the Dylan fit, just kind of a pretty kind of straightforward kind of slim fit uh, which I yeah I love to kind of wear uh, around this time of year um, and then I've got a black uh, bomber jacket uh, from ASOS this is kind of like a warm mix one um, I think this is so nice for a night out just love this one I think it could be just look really great with uh, yeah black pair of trousers and a black pair of boots um, so I've used the same pair of boots um, but of course you can uh, use a pair of Chelsea boots uh, or you know military style kind of lace up boots uh, if you want something a bit smarter than uh, this style which is maybe more of a kind of casual kind of uh, outdoor style I would say uh, but again I mean I just loved yeah the red black laces of the boots I uh, just thought just tied in really nicely with the tartan of the shirt so that was it for this uh, autumn outfit ideas video uh, all kind of based around styling flannel shirts 
Um, let me know what brands uh, of flannel shirts you like, uh, where you shop for them, uh, or if you do go vintage shopping, do you look out for Pendleton, Warwick, or is there another brand that you look out for that I haven't mentioned? Uh, let me know in the comment section down below. Um, if you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up, uh, also subscribe, um, I'd love to have you back for more videos. Um, you can also find me on Instagram, TikTok, I'll leave all those details uh, down below as well as my blog. Um, thank you so much for watching, I'll see you in the next one, take care, bye.